So each player, excluding the medic, uh, has a percentage, uh, obviously, as to what um, the likelihood of winning a point is, or winning a territory. Most likely we call it a point because, you know, there's five points in map. So, <laughs> um, uh, each, there's a lot of variance on the scoreboard. Like, are any of you good at maths, genuinely? Yep. Uh, yeah. Reasonable, yeah. Who, 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 okay, who said yep? Yep, me. Sorry, there's all of you teapot. talking. Teapot. Uni, so, so uh, and what class are you, Teapot? Oh, I scout. Oh, that's a shame. <laughs> 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 because, uh, yeah, that's the least... I mean, you're the first class on the field and you're most likely to die the most because you're a scout. Because uh, it should <laughs> what, be... What kind of maths is it that needs to it's, be done? It's, it's, it's quick statistical um, with a bit of algebra, logic, basically. It's mm. percentage based with logic. A level maths <laughs> progress off, so I'll give it a shot. I can do integral calculus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but PRB just doing the L'Hopital rule, no problem, while I'm in the TF2 game, sure. Yep. <laughs> okay. No, but the reason I'm saying is because um, there's a percentage on each player's head, and depending, there's also a percentage on each player's class, and there's also a percentage on the environment you're in, and there's also a percentage on the spawn wave you're in, there's also a percentage on what sort of position your team is in compared to the other team they're in. So height advantage as well. There's so many variants that you can mix up that it's just a clusterfuck. So you need to be able to do the bare basics. But to do that, you need to know the bare basics. So, um, okay. So the most obvious one that everyone seems to have learnt in, even from Div Six onwards, to be fair, that they've learnt from the pros or from Source TVs or whatever, is that if you lose your demo, it's sort of catastrophic. Not most <laughs> of the time. Yeah. Um, so everyone knows this one. That's a big thing because a down man technically counts as two players, right? He really does because he can do the damage. He can watch a trap. He can also deny area. He can also uh, cap now time uh, cap times two, and he's also got spam, and yeah. he's mobile. So he's pretty much got everything that a class needs, <laughs> except for the heals. He heals all the time. <laughs> um, so he's really, really powerful, which is why your dumb man is sh should be valuable and should value his life much more than other players, so to speak. So that's why soldiers, you always see soldiers kamikaze in more than dumb men, because there's only one of the dumb men, but also the fact that um, soldiers are more expendable, so to speak. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I often find myself going in to kind of pick their demo if they've got, like, they're t close to running a crux yeah. or something like that. Yeah. So, okay, so... Um, Taking that with a pinch of salt, the dumb man has a higher percentage already. As uh -huh. well, as, um, then we've got souls and scouts, pretty equal, um, depending on the role. Souls oh. and scouts are, oh, sorry. are pretty equal on percentages, so um, not much changes on the scoreboard when you're calculating if you can win a an area or not. And then you've got the medic, which is a huge percentage, depending on what's alive. So again, that's why I left the medic out when there was six. There's obviously six mm -hmm. on the team. I left the medic out on purpose because it's, it's quite dependent on on certain things. So um, let's start. Uh, uh, that's I mean that's the basic of the class's value. So let's just say uh, all the DMers on the field. So that's five of them. Um, mm -hmm. Let's just say each person is is twenty percent, but the dumb man's forty. So it's one hundred twenty percent. You've got <laughs> okay. <laughs> Okay. Or you could, we could we could knock it down so that everyone has like seventeen point something or fifteen point something percent, but it's going to be hard like, to round figures. So yeah, like yeah. 20. So let's say demo's forty, everyone else is twenty, and the medic's just a question mark for now. Um, so you've got the the uh, the class values. Um, now you've yeah. got uh, now you've got uh, not the amount of players that are up value, so to speak. So a typical scenario would be, which I'm pretty sure you lot would have been in, um, is if you've got three up a piece, okay, um, yeah. and you have a scout, a soldier, and a demo, and they have two scouts and a soldier, you would put the percentage on, assuming that you all have full health, not buff, but full health. So what would you put the percentage on? Like who? So, I mean, I'm winning. Sorry, who would you win? Who would you? Who would you think would win? Scout, soldier, and demo. Scout, scout, soldier. Two scouts and a soldier would win. I'd go for it. Yeah. Interesting. <laughs> I'd probably say 60 to the like the yeah, scout go. solo in the demo and 40 to the solo in the two scouts. It's interesting. Okay, because I would I'd say the same values but the opposite. So the demo, the soldier, and the scout. Um. Because Dumb Man's quite powerful, and Dumb Man can do damage from a distance, whereas Scouts cannot. Wait, did I say that the 
like the equal one, like Zemo and the Scout and the Soli, would be like 60. Is it, is it, is it ah, okay. Maybe, I don't know. Either oh, way, right. that's, that's what I would say. But anyway, the point is, let's just say they're on full health. You're on full health. In theory, you guys should win, because you have a Delman. Not only can he do spam, he can also do stickies, he can also deny it by an area, and also, like, in theory, you guys should win. So another thing comes to <laughs> a factor, but this is not part of the scoreboard, is focus fire, which is a team thing, obviously. You know, if you're focusing fire, then in, let's just say you're both focusing fire very well, but again, you have a down one, they don't. You, sh you should, in theory, win. So we're taking assumptions of the fact that you all have full health, and uh, you're, you focus fire well like a team, just like, you know, the enemy team does. But um, let's just say uh, another factor would be for the scoreboard, if you look at it, is let's just say you have all your players uh, but your demo are weak and that they're pretty buffed, or not buffed, but they've got good health. Um, then you would favour the the fight to... The scouts. Yeah, the scouts and soldier, and rightly so, that's right. Okay, now let's just say if we said you got a demo, a scout and a medic, and they have two scouts, the soldier. And yeah, you're pushing onto middle, or re pushing onto middle. What would you What's say the, then? What 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 was the other one to the demo and the medic? You've got one? you've got scout, demo, medic, and then you've got two scouts and soldier. Two scouts and soldier. You two think scouts and um, soldier. Yeah. Yeah. Like okay. Same. And I'd what are you basing that on? Buffs. Well, the met, although the demo man is like more powerful as a thing, if you've got two scouts flanking the the uh, medic and the demo, demo's not very good at close range. Okay. Medic be healed. Oh, well, I wouldn't say it wasn't. And the medic w would only have two people to heal. Okay. Like, yeah. Instead of like, and healing like... the scout wouldn't be too much useful. And two scouts might out the end of one scout. Okay, interesting. Is there anything else that you need to figure? Uh, if let's just say that was in the game scenario, is there anything else you need to take into factor? If you have um, an say Uber, buffs. with the medic had an Uber. Okay, let's just say the medic doesn't have Uber. I'd say buffs, buffs because if the one team is going in with full buffs from the medic and the other one isn't, it's a team just coming out of spawn with buffs or whatever. Okay, anything else? There's one really important thing you've all missed so far. Positioning. Uh, positioning is a minor, but it is a, it is a factor. Oh, but they're pushing in. What do you mean? Explain it a little bit. You might have it. I'm not sure. I'm trying to see. Like they're pushing in, so like, I don't know. Maybe the scouts would have good position to, or the soldier would be able to jump, jump them, or whatever. Oh, well, let's put it this way, right? If if it's the two scouts and a soldier, and even if they're on middle, and then you're in your house and pushing out onto middle, you in theory still should be able to muscle them out because you have heals, they do not. Right? If your demo man hit a grenade on the scout, he's going to piss off straight away because he knows the scout's going to clean him up. Right? So, um, ah. position isn't key, so to speak. However, there's still another thing um, that you really need to think of when pushing onto a point or off a point or something. The respawn. Again. Ah, yeah, the respawn. The respawn. Like, if, if you're trying to recap middle when they're three down, you need to think about the other three that are going to spawn because what's going to happen is you could end up killing them eventually, but you lose a player and then they all get spawners and they'll try and recap or kill you and then recap. Because don't forget you're outnumbered to start yeah, with. Yeah, your medic's in the way. Yeah. yeah. So, another factor you need to take into consideration is the spawn time. This is what I was um, trying to explain to you. Um, there's so many variants that you need to remember. Um, yeah, it's just practice. Like once you get used to it, it's it's a piece of cake. It will come natural. You don't even need to remember numbers. You just you'll know. But yeah, you need to take into consideration the spawn time. So let's just say now I'll give you the I'll give you what it was. So let's just say the spawn time they ju they just died. Like the other three yeah. just died. So what so are your chances of winning middle now? In theory. So it's like a twenty second respawn. Yeah, no, they they you they've got middle. So obviously the spawn time is less. You know that the spawn times differ depending on the point, right? Is it not like closer you get to like last? The longer the it is. The longer it is. Yeah. yeah, that's right. Yeah, the closer you get to middle, the, the shorter it is. The closer uh, you get to last, or the more further away you are towards last, it's uh, it's longer. So, um, yeah. So what are your chances now? In theory, um, it should be much higher. It really should be. Yeah, be You've got, yeah. You have heals. They really don't have heals. So all you need to do is not even go aggro. You just need to pick them off or, or do so much damage that they have to drop out. Because most most players at Div 6, I'm not going to lie, 4, 5, 3, 2, 
maybe even one, they'll just drop back because they're scared of dying and they don't realize that they should carry on forward focusing fire on whatever it is they were going for. So in theory yeah. you have medic, they don't. So all you need to do is take a hit a little bit but not die and just focus fire with your demo and your scout and you should be able to clean up. Now that's two versus three in terms of DM. So you could lose a player but you could end up winning it as well. I I don't know, what do you think guys? What Do you think it would be a higher or a lower percentage to win? Um, Assuming that they just died, like the other three. So they're not going to spawn for a good while. I would say if the scouts and the soldier focus properly, they could like take down the demo pretty quickly. And then it's yeah. just a soldier and a medic. Yeah, so it's all about getting in there quickly and cleaning up, making sure that they don't get spawners in time. So that, Or they may get spawners in time, but they won't be able to re recontest the point that you're going for, is my point. Yeah. Um, but mm -hmm. as you can see, all those factors that I've just mentioned, can someone like summarize all the factors I've just mentioned just uh, so you can see if I see if you've actually uh, understood or remembered right. do you want to call me? one uh -huh. of you is fine uh, heals, respawns, classes, uh, DM <coughs> numbers when you say numbers what do you mean by numbers? Uh, like how many there is oh okay yeah yep yeah, yep yeah. just the types of classes and stuff high advantage yeah, there's none in this case, but yeah, that's right. Yep. Anything else? Ooh, we've forgotten something, haven't we? Uh, buffs. No, nah, I mean DM. DM is is irrelevant because you can, that doesn't you can't tell on the scoreboard. Like you know, if someone's got the DM, <laughs> have you got the eye yeah, of the tiger? It? DM. No, sorry. <laughs> but uh, but uh, and uh, heals you can only tell from spectate when you're dead, but it's mm. some sort of a factor. But anyway, um. Yeah, you, you mentioned them all, so that's fine. Okay, so now you just need to remember that combination in every single scenario you go to. <laughs> Sounds yeah. easier said than done, unfortunately. That's the problem. Yeah. So, um, uh, let's see now. So, is, uh, they also would also be like, you know, like when you kind of assume their oops, oops percentage, would that also be a kind of factor? Of course, yeah, yeah. I mean, we're just assuming that the medic doesn't have Uber. Your medic doesn't have Uber. So, he's dead. <laughs> well, that's to say, if he is, but, um, right, okay. So does everyone understand the basics then? Yeah. Uh, I think is there so, anything? Yeah. Okay. So, um, at what point are you checking this? Is this before going in, while you're in? Uh, well, you're, you're supposed to be calculating <laughs> as that you're losing players and they're losing to it, as they're losing players as well. Okay, so, so just as, like check, checking pretty consistently. Yeah, it's on the go. I mean. If I was to tell you how many times I press the scoreboard, it'd be well over 200 in 30 minutes. So, yeah, in your <laughs> streams, you just like press you, it all the I time. Like, yeah, yeah, yeah. It, it's it's needed though because I need to update like every time what's going to happen. If something gets changed, then the thing is, as soon as as a caller, like as a main caller, as soon as you start getting out of sync, then it becomes really hard to go back, and you have to wait a few minutes, and then you could end up losing a round for do it. Do you um do you use the the kill feed as well. Uh, I only I know I only use the kill feeds for to see if mass killings have happened basically. So if mass killings has happened, I look at the scoreboard straight away to see what's been killed. Okay. I don't go. Um, the only, the only time I use probably the kill feed if I was really to use it was because I know players in prem and if I know that they've gone in, like for example if it's Walters and he was obviously he plays yeah. scout, but then I know he's just died, then I know he's going to go sniper. But I would look yeah. on the scoreboard anyway. So. Okay. Okay. Um, so uh, yeah, I mean, uh, it would have been—I don't know—I was just saying to um, Cool Beans that it would have probably been cool with um, with a demo to give you, because there's lots of scenarios in a demo you can pick and choose. But that's why I was wondering how you want to do it on a map. Um, if there's if there's Beans, things on we a map, use a demo, couldn't we? I mean, that's up to you. But I mean, we can also do it on a map. So if there's, but you'll need to the thing is you'll need to describe the scenario, which obviously takes longer and so on and so forth. So mm. it's up to you. Um, I mean, do you guys want to download a demo that we've done recently, if we can get one? Uh, I've got plenty. Uh, yeah, same. When you say you, do you mean P POV or, or Source TV? Source um, TV. Source TV. Uh, uh, look, I admit that I only realised about one minute ago you were talking about like video demos and not like the demo man. <laughs> <laughs> oh! <laughs> wait, were you at- oh, wait, wait. <laughs> were you actually saying demos in the chat? Oh, you were. Oh dear. 
Uh, oh no, you, no, okay, no, you weren't. Okay, that's good. Right. Oh. Um, never mind. Um, I've. T what do you want to do? What demos? You've got plenty. I've got plenty of demos. It's up to you guys. So, I, I think, the, I think the more I go over them, the more you'll get a feel as to how you should be calling them <laughs> yeah. and what taking okay. into fact. It doesn't make a difference. What? As long as they're not rolls, five nils doesn't mean anything to me because you don't learn anything from that. It's got to be something well, where. How about the one that we did where we got two five? And it was kind of like with the quiet games. When you what, say the roll, the 6-2 one. Oh, 6-2. Six two. Six two. Was that 30 yeah. minutes, though? That's it was, it must yeah. have been. Yeah, 6 two must have been, yeah. Yeah, that was probably the worst game we've had there. this season. Yeah. The worst, really? Yeah, no, the worst game we've had this season. 6-2 on a map and 5-0. No. Oh, well, that would be different. better than us rolling someone. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, we're not getting rolled ourselves, but it's quite an even game, although... So you lost 6-2? We lost 6-2. Yeah. What, man? Uh, we lost 6 Yeah. Badlands. Oh, okay. Badlands. Cool. Uh, is there any more even ones you could have? I think that's quite a good one to show. Do we have the first one from... GC? I'd rather go over one where we lose than one where we, we win. Sorry, JC. Jolly we could have the Gully Wash Golden Cap one if you wanted, if I can find that one. The ones with the uh, the ones where you win normally are the ones where you refine your sort of your game sense, and the ones where you lose is the ones where you fix the, the basics. Normally, that's how it works. So, pick one that's the one that's where you've lost, and we'll do that first, and then we can do the, the winning one after. Okay, uh, so we do. Let's do Granary. Not gra yeah, Granary that we won against JC and. Six no. two on Badlands to Okay, right, let me find the drop box. Well I, I, I've Leary always sends me the drop box because I keep forgetting. Uh right, sorry, I'm just gonna stop scout the enemy because just <laughs> Okay. Uh let's see. Make sure you all have a bind for demo uh, uh, underscore toggle pause thing. So it's easy mm. to pause it. I just do it manually. Right, I've got the granary one. What, demo underscore pause? Demo toggle underscore pause. toggle pause. It should be in console when you see it. Can I get out my TF file? So how's your season going by? Are you playing? I've hardly been playing, to be honest, mate. I mean, we've lost the first two, but I mean, we, ha we should have been played. We should have played another three officials, but I haven't been oh, around. Wow. Um, been strapped at work um, with this project I'm working on, so no chance, unfortunately. Playing soldier though. Pocket fun a pocket soldier is great, but soldier is a shit class because it's so underpowered. It's annoying. I don't know. I like, soldier. like you'd have to you'd have to get three like three air shots, and then even that isn't enough to kill a buff soldier. It's such a retarded class. Like yeah. that's so unjustified. Hmm. <laughs> Why so is it put up with? <laughs> Now you understand our pain. A down man doesn't need that, you know. <laughs> One sticky, two grens is enough. I know. I do, yeah, I do think it's underpowered as a class compared to the rest. Maybe at prem levels. Well, because there's four, there's four damage a soldier. Yeah, true. That's the problem. A scout is more about up close and personal. It's always a hundred, a hundred, hundred. So three hundred can be done in three shots. <laughs> a soldier getting two air shots is like at a distance is probably like what 160, 70. Hmm. It's tar It's retarded. And I played obviously medic. It's, it's, uh, Demo and obviously soldier, but not at the highest level for soldier. But and yeah, it's definitely not the uh, most powerful class. <laughs> it can't change the uh, the team mechanics, whereas a dumb man can. Yeah. You play? Oh, you play pocket? Yeah. Yeah. Well, dumb man can change everything around. Like let's just say you've lost the point. He's got a nice sticky trap up. Medic down. You start recontesting. I mean, a soldier can only do that if the medic enemy medics were retard, you know. <laughs> If he, does, if he has the Uber and it doesn't pop, and he loses yeah. it to a soldier he's seen right in front of his face, then... <laughs> Get the take. Yeah. Fish death needs to stop popping to one soldier. Yeah. She's, I think she was just really nervous that game, to be honest, because it was against the Kawaii people, so she was not taking any chances whatsoever. Mm hmm. 
Mm. Is this your medic you're talking about? Yeah. A bit nervous. That's alright. <laughs> Itchy trigger finger, huh? So what, she twitches and just pops it early? No. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah, yeah, I went under threat, but maybe like we could have probably dealt with it. Yeah. I find the best way to soothe a medic, so to speak, is to give them confidence by giving the comms as to whether it's safe or not. And then if yeah. you say it is, then it's not her fault or his fault. Yeah, true. That's what I do with the CVM, and he, well, he does that most of the time. And thanks for the tip. Which is hard to control that one, I tell you. <laughs> nah, but seriously, uh, before when I used to play with UCAT, I never played with UCAT, I'm just helping them out the season, but they, uh, he always used to pop early, and it's such a disadvantage because you're, yeah, you're like three seconds short now of an Uber. Yeah. So it's really AIDS, especially if you multi Uber, it's even worse. So I just give um, him confidence by saying no stickies, CVM, it's clear, no need to use, no stickies, no, no soldier, it's clear, CVM, no sniper, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So he knows not to use, and then if he loses it, it's not his fault. Because I said it was clear, so it's yeah, on my shoulders. Well, that's the thing that the they twitch and use it because they're scared of losing it, and then obviously the whole team is like, oh. Yeah, and then the medic feels bad, even yeah. though he, they would feel worse if they dropped. Yeah. Remember, you need to do that. Will do. How's it going, Cool Beans? Just getting. Wait, don't know how Dropbox works. Which ones are you looking for? If it's on your uh, Dropbox, you should be able to just click a link. Oh to yeah, it. share Dropbox link. Yeah. What, what what does that do? Um, what it just do? has a link to that one file. Okay, so do I just like copy paste it? Then? Yeah, yeah. yeah post it's like a direct right. link, basically, from your Dropbox. Yeah. Oh yeah, how oh, useful. Okay, this is the Metalworks one or the bad just bad one. Ah, okay, I've got all my demos like <laughs> named properly. Kawaii, huh? Nice. Yeah. Well, Supposedly the best team in our division. This file yeah. is uploading at the moment, so I'm, I'll wait. Yeah. And that's the granary one. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I don't know how long it's going to take to upload, but no. Do you have broadband or fiber? Only a... uh, it's pretty good, anyways. But <laughs> it's, like... only, it's only a few. Kilobytes, isn't it? it shouldn't take Megabytes, long. it's like 20 meg. meg. If you zipped it, it would have been much smaller. It goes to half its uh, size. Uh, <sighs> you <laughs> twat. I'm so sorry. <laughs> At least you have to extract uh. it. Oh no! You're so thoughtful. <laughs> Anyone watch the rugby? Anyone fan of rugby? Who no. was playing? Uh, England and Ireland. England won. Yeah, just it was pretty cool though. It was really intense. Uh, yeah, you'll probably see many, many things wrong with our play in the next match. But <laughs> <laughs> well, the thing it's is, it's to be expected. Well, I think if it makes you feel any better, um, lots of mistakes are made at Prem. <laughs> <laughs> so, so, what? <laughs> yeah, believe it or not, most of the people don't know how to game sense in Prem. It's just a few callers who know how to, who understand the game. Fair enough. So. We should and have to be moving up to Div 5 game. after this. Oh no, the, the other players who don't have the game sense just have the pure DM. And it's that good. Yeah. So. Hey, many names. Who's the game sense person you played with? Sorry? Who's the least game sense Prem player that you played with? That's just asking for gossip right there. <laughs> <laughs> Who's the least? Uh, oh, there's been loads. I mean, I've been playing for years. Well, I have to rattle my old brain. <laughs> um. There's loads, I can't pick one specifically. <laughs> uh, I generally can't pick one at the moment. Um, oh, these files are still uploading. Come on, cool beans. I'm sorry, I don't know. I'm just like waiting them and just like you. I'm to upload. I hope I'm doing the right thing. They've got like, oh, the oh, quiet one's um, up. The quiet one's up, yeah. The quiet one's up. No, just take just. That's alright, it won't take too long then. That means the other one. So we can just watch this one. Uh, download this and watch this one while the other one uploads. Which one is this yeah. one? 
Uh, Kawhi is the Guanary one, apparently. No, sorry, Badlands one, where you won. Yeah, oh, you Badlands lost one. six two. All right. Yeah. 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 Uh huh. Yeah. I think what the difference was between like their team and ours is that they knew what they were doing every single push like we went into yeah. and then we kind of just didn't have that sort of organization really i think that's some main hold up is not knowing what to do when push pushing or defending like completely all right okay i'm in i'm in it let me just load up make sure you have the pause thing wait do we not all yeah, have I did the pause I thing. did we not I'm pretty I, sure I we have. have them. We have all them. have the Kawhi one because I literally, because we all did a scrim review in this. I had so. the Kawhi one. Uh, I didn't. Have oh, it. also be prepared. They're a bit, of, they're a bit, a bit kind of dicks. That's all right. Yeah. I wouldn't worry about it. I still have that in prem as well. Sticks everywhere you go, no matter what school level. <laughs> um. Okay. Just uh. Uh, anyone know what ticket starts? Um, oh, I'll have a look. On. <coughs> Let's see. We get um, into the respawn room at tick three eight four. Three eight four. Okay, fine. So not... Okay. Uh, let us know when you're all ready, guys, and like you got it loaded all and right. stuff. But be prepared to pause it and yeah, bring the score because it's going to be quite a few times, like over 20, probably 30 times. Because <laughs> there's lots of scenarios. So. Okay. And feel free to ask. Found as well. Feel free to ask any yeah. questions at any stage if you're not sure about something. Okay, so everyone ready? Uh, One second. I'm just okay. Say when, cool beans. Give me a second. Just need to change some binds so I can get those first person specs. <laughs> Okay, I'm downloading the other one as well, the demo. It's uh, done as well. Right, I'm... What's the command to bind? Just bind, then a key, and then... toggle pause. Or oh, something. toggle pause uh, demo. Uh, I'll send it to Steam. Demo underscore toggle pause is the command. Can you just send it to me as well, please? That'll bind L to uh, pause and unpause. Okay, I'm ready. Cool, so we're ready? You ready, Cool Beans? Cool Beans. Huh? Um. <laughs> yeah, I'm yeah, you're ready. Good. Yeah, I'm good. <laughs> okay. They went. Okay, cool. Um, let's uh, let's go now. Oh, I forgot to say I'm on tick 400 now, going up from there. Who are you specking? I'm no, no, I know. I'm just bird's eye for now. Just be just be ready to pause it. That's all the main thing. Yeah, I'm gonna watch myself. I'm on bird's eye view on middle, but. I'm not going to analyze what why middle went wrong because that's not a transition. It's a rollout. That's so. just a, that's just yeah, a fight, yeah. big fight. In yeah, the it's your positioning of where you are and stuff. That's different. So. Okay. So pause it. Okay. So actually, I don't know where where does where do you and the medic go? Here, yeah. Do you know? Uh, medic runs off to trash. I got I got jumped. Okay, and what's the likelihood of you holding second? Low. None. Very low. None. Right. Yeah. So, why would you make it be in trash? Uh, why is Lish in trash? I may be running away from the scout, I assume. What scout? Panic. There's a scout on her. Wait, what tick are you guys on? <coughs> I'm, I'm on uh, 2,923. Yeah, I'm on 3,100. Okay. Is everyone ahead of uh, ahead of me? Am I behind? Is that why? I'm two thousand nine hundred. Okay. Same. I'm a bit. I'm a bit ahead. Okay. Well, the chances are uh, of you winning this and holding second is nothing, right? Okay. Yeah. And what are the chances? Okay. So this is something else a main caller would be calling, even if he's dead. What are the chances of your medic dying? 
now? Pretty high. Very high. high. And what are the yeah. chances? What are the chances of which exit the scout's going to come from, or or whatever class it is that's chasing the medic? Reset. What's the percentage? Oh, high, so sixty. About sixty, seventy. Yeah, higher. So probably about seventy. Um, Haunter and Choke. So ten, twenty, respectively, whichever way round. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Like, I'm just trying to. You see what I'm trying to say? I'm trying to get the yeah. whole percentages into your head. Like, what are the chances <clears> of you being in the position you're in actually going to favour in for you? And it's quite obviously <laughs> zero point zero 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 percent. So at this stage, what is the best scenario you can do? Get back to last. last. Back to last, build right? Scout. And build your Uber, right? To stand a yep. percentage chance of holding last, right? Yep. Cool. All right. And so let's get ready to unpause. Uh, maybe you, uh, not you. Um, whoever yeah, said, I'll, I'll wait for. Yeah. Uh, I'm paused now. And we'll win cool, the cool when this dies. Yeah, it doesn't die. Oh, I saved her. Good job. Yeah, Please. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, yeah, well done. Okay. And then we get back up to life. Everybody's skating around for me now. It's beautiful. That's not jittery. Percentage of your down man dying here? Uh, where is careful. he? He's bottom he's left. Yeah, he's he dropping. Luckily he didn't die, but he could have got flanked from top left, man. Anyway. Yeah, very close. Okay, so percentage now of holding? 50-50, um, right? 100%. Yeah. Pretty much like them. Um, you lost the player, they lost the player. So I make the stupid idea see that of going sniper, I think, which kind of reduced my abilities here, because I just... I think they saw me, and so they decided to go top right instead, and I just get basically fragged out. Let's get taken by the spam. Yep, and you lose that. Okay, so pause it. So you lost that because, not because it's a sniper to be fair, um, that wasn't the only reason. Like You lost the player fine, it didn't help. So you, your chances of, of winning or holding this is what, after you lost the sniper? Um, when they were behind the point, I think we all got a bit distracted, so... We were all distracted by the Solly here, <laughs> and then there's a scout, and, uh... Alright, okay, let's, uh, I'll, let me start again, okay. Your percentage, when it was, everyone was, oh, it was 5 versus 5, because there was one player down on each team, then when they were pushing... Yeah, it's like what, 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 okay, and then, your sniper went down, what was the percentage then? 45. I'd say 70, 30. I'd say 45. There's a good reason. Um... Okay, and then what happened after that? There's one key thing that I think all of you have missed. I went heavy. Sorry? Heavy? No, no, yeah, heavy is a good option. That's fine. Heavy's not the issue. You all drop down. So yeah, just you're, all on the the you're all on the floor. Okay, and the soldier's yeah. above you. He gets your demo. So let's put that put the height factor in consideration. What would you give the percentage then if they were on high and you're on low ground? 80-20 to them. Yeah, 80-20. So what are the chances of you holding? Low. Very low now, right? Okay, so now you know how how it's deviated. So it's deviated because of the fact that you lost position on top, basically. The sniper dying wasn't the worst thing in the world. It really wasn't. Like, yeah, it, it, it would have been better for him to be up. Fine. However, you could have easily made it up because they used the Uber first. So right. that sniper dying was the, was the equivalent of them having to use it three seconds earlier. If that makes any sense. So it wasn't the end of the world. Mm -hmm. That's why forty five percent. I would agree with. No, what I was saying was that if we had a scout instead. Yeah, if we had a scout, it would have helped, obviously, but it, if we lost the, the, the percentage of losing that player, especially if it was because it was just a sniper, it wasn't the end of the world, because they had to Uber oh, earlier. Yeah. So yeah. the percentage is still 45 to, to 55. Um, but then you lost a considerable percentage because you all dropped down. Now, I can't remember. Why did you drop down? I can't actually remember because I've gone past I think it. a soldier got on the point, so we all went for it. No, the soldier got onto the point at the end, didn't he? Yeah, but yeah, what got behind? Nice. I don't know why. Oh, that was it. I'm pretty sure the, the medic dropped down to the floor to keep the heavy alive. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's yeah. And then the pocket followed. Yeah, and then the pocket followed, and the demo followed, and the demo went down because their soldier had high advantage, your, your demo didn't, and the soldier didn't, and the heavy didn't, which means your percentage was pretty, pretty low of winning that. Also, anymore. The, reason, the reason I was down, I saw it, I got knocked down the stairs. So instead of going back up the stairs, I went out through the archway. Right. And I should have gone back up the stairs. Yeah. Either way, basically position was what cost you there. So, yeah, I'm just right. So you've seen how I've like literally scaled it down. It's quite logical, isn't it? Mm -hmm. yeah. um, this, this, this. Therefore, percentage this, this, this. Okay, that's how you need to think all the way through. So um, let's get ready to unpause it now. 
So a good round has been said, 1-0, now you're pushing on to the middle. In the moment, like, class-wise, we did have better classes on You did. did, that's why it was still 50-50. <laughs> and even when you lost the sniper, it was still a good percentage. Yeah. But you lost position, which is a huge thing on Badlands, unfortunately. Because um, you know, everyone yeah. knows it so well, you just abuse the people's positioning. Okay, so... Good job. So let's pause it here. Okay, so you're four up, they're one up, yeah? And one of the scouts would have been called that he's weak, he's on 50 HP, isn't he? So, chances of you winning the next point? Uh, uh, pretty high. Let's roll on yeah. to it, yeah. Yeah? Okay. Um, uh, without this is not a scoreboard thing, but what should you be doing on uh, on um, middle? Who should be capping? Scouts. 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 I like how all of you said that really quickly, because logically you're right, logically. But if you're trying to make scouts can go ahead. exactly, you get times four on spiral with two scouts, because the the strength of spiral is meat shotting scouts blocking anything, isn't it? So you can have times two with the medic and the soldier while the scouts go up and get they get they get they get a buff, they go to second, and then they get both points for free. Okay. To see so how you that think that's what we should be doing each time, just sending no, scouts uh, Only no, 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 on, only, on only in this case because they're five down. Yeah, because this, but this happens quite relatively often. We could do yeah. that. Put that yeah, but that. So, your percentages of winning middle, obviously, at hundred percent. There's no question there. Um, your percentages of winning second, at the moment, in my eyes, if it's played correctly, is ninety percent. Like it'd have to be one, six scout to pick off two players here. That scout has got to do some serious picking, and I don't think yeah. he'll do it. Okay, so um, the chances of you winning that is 90 to 95 percent. Okay, so that's the scoreboard taken care of. As a, if that was me as a medic, I'd be saying go straight away. But the scouts, the scouts, I'd be saying go straight away, and the soldier and me will cap. And then um, what? See, are the normally we do it the other way around. Like we're yeah, yeah, that's the yeah. The standard, the standard is yeah. But think about it, right? If you send a soldier and a medic onto spiral, how easy for, is it for you both to get on that point? And how much of a times cap point? Are you going to be on there? You're going to be either times yeah. two or times three at max, right? Plus, when people come, you've got to airshot them. Yeah, and you've got to airshot them as well. And the medic can't really do that. So you. So it's, it is only for spiral, like for all maps in general. No, 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 no. It's dependent on the situation. I'm I'm giving you a tip there. That's nothing to do with the scoreboard. I'm just telling you as a tip. I would send yeah, two scouts cool. if you've got two scouts with a soldier. Um, or even let's just put it this way: if you've got two scouts, a soldier, and a demo, no medic even. Let's just say you've got good enough health. Even if you don't have good enough health, I would still say the scouts go. And the demo man with the pain I was train. Just, yeah, I was just watching a metal works where the demo man stayed behind every time to cap. Yeah. Um, so it's dependent on the situation. So going back to the scoreboard, your percentage of winning is 95% here on middle. Oh, sorry, 100% on middle. 95% on second, um, if not 100. Okay, as long as it's executed correctly, right? Yep. yep. What? Okay. The last final thing. What is the percentage of of them trying to stop it? Them really trying to stop it. Really and, um, without low. looking, without looking at the fact that their spawn time is like that, would someone remember their spawn time? No. Well, we'd have someone. De would they be able to see? No, I don't know. No, no, no. You wouldn't. That's something you need to learn. The spawn times. Now, how yeah. soon did they die on middle? If they died all in one go, you've got no problem. However, if they died in botch pieces, then you have well, got a had, problem. We had the main bomb and then two picks. So yeah, so gonna it's be pretty much all in one, one go. Some, yeah. I mean, ten eighteen is pretty much all in one go in my eyes. If it was, if you've got like someone with eighteen and two, someone spawning in two seconds, that's a botch thing. That's yeah, someone yeah, died yeah. right at the start and then you've just killed the rest at the end. You know what I mean? So, um, so what are the chances of them trying to recap or stop? Actually, I would say. Well, well I, I'm not sure percentage, but in my mind, they're not going to try and cap. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And what? Um. <laughs> and sorry, this is going to be quite harsh. But what are the chances of of someone on your team fucking it up? Fucking up the cat. Um. Well, something like that. No, no, no. Well, let's just say you cap the point, and then normally what happens typically in any div, in most divs, they think they can go forward. What are the chances of you losing players? Four um, eight. Four eight. Okay. And what are the chances of that affecting you on second? I don't think we're going to lose many players on second. I don't think there's going to be contestion. Okay, scenario would be both scouts have gone to second. They've capped, but they think, oh yeah, they're on top of the right. world. They go. The, they chan the chances, I would say, the chances of a scout, two scout getting killed on the way there, if there was a scout up, 
would be something like 30% or something like that. And then that would impact on capping the point by about 40%. No, no. Let's just, let's just say, no, no, let's just say your scouts don't have a problem capping the point, okay? So they cap the point. But my point is, normally what you get is both scouts go forward, okay? Let's just say they get smashed. Yeah, I'd say there's a chance one of them will be picked off. Okay, and what's, what, like okay, let's, just, let's just say both are picked off. What are the chances yeah. of you losing second? Um, I would Fairly say... High. Okay, so I, well, I'm trying. I'd say, 60, I, I'd say we'd back up if that happened. I'm trying to, like, yeah. I'm trying to. Take. I'm trying to register this to, so you know as a as a main yeah, caller. I've, I've got like I've got it all going on in my head, but I don't have the percentages. Like that's I'll just fine. Be, like, like in my head, it's just like, oh, we should probably back off now because that's happened. Rather okay. Than, oh, we've got a six percent chance of. So, so what I'm trying to lead to is, what as a main caller would you be saying to your scouts as they just capped? Don't push out. Oh. Wait for the team. Come back for heels. Yeah, come back. Basically, you've done your job. You've capped the point. Come back. You don't need to go any further, you don't need to be greedy, you don't need to try and get a pick, blah blah blah, just come back. And that's what I'm, I'm basically, I'm trying to lead on to the fact that, you you know, as a main caller I would be saying that, because I know that scouts just like to go forward all the fucking time, because they're just impatient fucks. They are really Amen. impatient. That's why they picked the cooker's class. <laughs> it's true, come on, I don't think anybody can die. It is, it is. Yeah. It is, it is so true. you need to I remind them, because they're, tr they're trigger happy, they, they like to go for, for frags. So as a main caller, I was saying, yep, yeah, come back. Because you don't want to lose the point after you've just lost two players for when you, you do a good move. Mm. Yeah. Okay. So now that you've figured out all the percentages, this, I don't know if you do get second, by the way, but let's just unpause it now. So um, we've got two scouts on this. So now that you know that you should switch it around, no problem. We've got a soldier on his own. I don't know what this is doing. No, basically I was telling... Okay, so we pause it now? Yep. So... Um, what are the chances of you getting this now? Lower, Still? The same? 55th. Well, oh, they've just to, now. to 70. I'd say they've got a chance of contesting it now. Uh, they've, they've I'm guessing you guys, I'm guessing you guys knows percent. what happens because you played the game. Can I, I can't just ask? What happens. I, don't rem I don't remember. Anyone remember? I think it, it was last week. Okay, no worries, no worries, it's fine. Um, okay, so the percentage has gone down though, no? Mm -hmm. It's got to yeah. have because you haven't got any yeah. scouts on the point as you capped middle. So it's yeah. definitely gone down. Every second you lose is like a 3% off. So you, you've lost like, well, I don't know, 6, 7 seconds. So you've lost about 20 odd, 25% off that. Okay, so you contest this, right? So, I mean, you go for the point. So let's unpause now. We get it, I think. Yep, I think we get it. yep so... Um, <laughs> We're still just kind of walking around. Yep. Oh, and, right, then you should have jumped and then our scouts cap. Well, one yeah, scout one of the scouts does. And you've already overextended, I don't know who that is, someone's That's extended me. onto Hello. the balcony. <laughs> I've, so I've luckily they didn't they didn't contend it, fine. But that wasn't ideal. The scout going second reset was not needed, it could have just gone straight from choke onto the cat point times four, would have put them off, you know, 100% basically. So, but anyway, uh, you have an uber advantage. I think we're wanting to push this pretty... Yep, that's good. So, so uh, pause it. I know you should be probably uber now, right? Yeah, 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 yeah it's, it's fine. Done it's fine. That's fine. That's fine. So, um, first of all, before we go into this, what's I've just seen someone die on their team, but ignoring that, it was six versus six. Well, what was the percentage of what's the percentage of you winning this? Seventy, um, 60, 60, 40. Okay. 40. And why is it only sixty? Tell me what the factors uh, are okay. affecting. What what are the factors affecting you from it being a oh, hundred? Uh, uh, they haven't popped yet, and they are all on the high ground at the moment. They've got the high ground, definitely. Okay, so do you reckon somebody would have calculated the fact that they don't have Uber? I think we uh, assume they didn't have it. I think. I there. think list, list would have. That's why we wanted to push what quickly. What does? He watches it when they come up and then guess kind of like what percentage they'll be at. Well, make a an extremely educated guess, like to around the ten percent, like how much they have. Okay, and what other factors are, are stopping you from saying a hundred percent? Off passing. Uh, off. I'd Wait. say positioning at the moment. Because positioning, because at, at the moment we only have how many players in? We've just gone through the door. We yeah, have door. Leary and we've got Lish here, and then we've got Crambo behind them, and then we've got Teapot and Huntsy just in bottom left. Yeah. Just... I see. Yeah. And then we've got me uh, just about coming from top trying to. Distract them a bit. Okay, in an ideal situation, what should the percentage be? Obviously, besides saying 100, but. 50 50. Well, ideal. No, no. Uber, you have Uber, ideal. they don't. 80%. 80 yeah, 80%. exactly, right? Because you're going to lose 10 or 20 because of sinking. <clears throat> Fine. 
Okay. So what does it depend on? On you winning this? When they pop their Uber, if they have an Uber. So what should be your focus? Uh, demo. Medic. 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 Both. Both. I mean, you can say, that, yeah. The Medic is, I would say, just ahead. But if you kill the demo, it means automatically exposure on the point. So either one will work. Either one. Either way it will work. But um, uh, yeah. The problem is you only have a demo at the moment in with the Uber, but you have no soldier helping him. So high advantage isn't an issue because at the moment you've got Uber, so you're invincible. So like you said, the only thing that could really affect you is light classes, so the pyro. Now that would yeah. really cons considerably put your percentage down, so it could go from 80 all the way down to 30, 20. Yeah, they've got a uh, sniper on the left side. Sniper's well, irrelevant at the moment because you're yeah. Ubered, so he's useless. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, yeah. Okay. No, now I'm going to bust this. So, <laughs> okay, so you, you think, I, I don't know if you guys can remember, can you win, do you win this? Yeah, I, I think we yeah, yeah, I think it's, I think you bought it. Okay, you cool. So let's unpause. Demo does well, to be fair. Gets two picks, two important picks, and did you get the demo? Yeah, you did, didn't oh. you? You did. Yeah, like, and I told you, what did I say? It's important. The demo is really important on Badlands. Yeah, that's why I would say before the medic, because you can easily flank it and get on the point. Regardless mm. if they have Uber, they may not get on the point in time. But anyway, um, back to middle. Uh, we gonna. Oh, we have already. Shit, oh, already on middle. Let's pause it now, guys, just so we can get back. So I'm on okay. tick uh, 15,218. Okay. I'm about yeah, there, I'm yeah. Okay, just wait for whoever is fine. Okay. Don't call being just slow person. I'm sorry. Are you ready? Uh... No. Okay, so get ready to unpause now. Okay, so we're on middle. Um, they're fighting, you're fighting. Spam, spam, spam. Blah, blah, blah. Our combo is in a bit of a dodgy place in the house, being spammed out. And five versus just... five. But we have bad positioning because we're just yep. we're all just locked in the house. And then I hey, pause it here. Actually, yeah, okay, you pause it. I was just gonna say, what's the likelihood of you getting this point now? Twenty thirty percent. Yeah, yeah. Based so on I have I have five players up, did. five players up for you, and three for them. Yeah. yeah. So, so what's the likelihood? Eighty. Okay. Oh, wow. okay. Okay. What's up for them? Two scouts and a demo. Yeah. Yeah. What's the likelihood of your medic going down? Where's her medic? Ah, uh, she is in a house with crumbs. No, 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 no. You don't get me. No. What's your What's your percentage of your medic going down when you go onto middle? Forget where the medic is at the moment. But let's just say you're going forward. You're going for the point. Regardless 40. of where you're coming from. Thirty. Thirty percent. Stay forty. A bit so, higher. It's a lot higher. You got two scouts and a demo. Sixteen. Oh yeah, because two scouts can go underneath, flank you, even up. It happens all the time in Badlands, doesn't it? They go up your slope, come behind. They go up on the. They come from shit house, come behind. You know, and a demo man can jump on you as well. So the chances of your medic dying are higher than normal. Let's put it that way. Because if they have a half a brain, you know, <laughs> they should really go. They should really go all aggro, because and get the medic. Especially with them with 221, because what it means is that they can hold last, for sure, and it may mean they can hold second. And it also equalizes out the Uber advantage. Yeah, that exactly. I just got from picking. So the head. that's what I'm trying to say. What's the percentage? So it's not high, high. It's it's definitely out there, though. I would be cautious. As a pocket soldier, I'd be shit worried about something coming from behind. Let's put it that way. I would okay. be looking behind. So you just need to. Okay. That's another percentage you need to take in consideration. So they've lost their medic. They're going to be going after yours because this, yeah, they need to try and make up with an advantage. Okay, so let's unpause it now. Now you get double air shotted though. Let's <laughs> see. <laughs> <laughs> so it's three versus three now. Let's pause it. What did I tell you about two scouts flanking and just ninjaing? It's quite lethal, isn't it? It's just they. I mean, they're on our slope. They're just raped cool beans as well. Yeah. Just, just yeah. Now, what are your chances of winning this? We've got a demo and a salt, and they still have their scout and demo up. Uh, I'd, I'd say, say it's gone 50. down. It's gone down because all like Lish is low. I don't know how much everyone else has because my scoreboards, because my uh, like my health percentage is yeah. messed up. So we're just about to lose our med because she's only got forty. 
Uh, Leary's taking hits, and Crambo's a bit out of position, and both the scouts are on the slope, just a way to attack Leary, who's currently looking the wrong direction, so I'd say it's about 65, 35. I know yeah. what happens here as well. I know what, <laughs> happens, what happens, I, I call out they're going through house. Uh, they back out through choke, back up to the other side of the house, they get flanked and Med goes down, I'm pretty sure. Okay. So, I asked you what was the percentage on middle when you had five up, when your medic was... Yeah. Uh, so it was like, th in my eyes it was about 40 uh, to 50. So what is it now? 65. For it's pretty, no, it's, it's a lot favorite. higher. It's a, No, I mean not to win middle or to hold it, oh. I mean to, to see a medic going down. Oh, yeah. 90. Yeah, very high now, right? So as a player, what would you be doing? You'd be, you know, Back off. Lick, Back off. licking his or, or her rectum to making sure that she doesn't get picked <laughs> off, basically. Or at least so she has enough time to to get the Uber and then pop it. Yeah, yeah? just watch the flames, so. like, all the time. Well, I'm just trying to get the percentages in you as, again, like, so you need to figure out what the percentage is now of your medic going down. And obviously it's a lot higher now with two scouts and a dome man who's gone to get some heals or get some health pack I think he did so um okay so let's unpause it okay, so here we yeah, go scouts scouts, scouts. Oh, both pop. scouts coming in uh, Good job. we just managed to get the pop off you've been in and you've gone to the point uh pausing it now okay so they're two down yeah and they've just got their bucket of respawns okay that's fine but they're two down so your chances of winning this now are Winning uh, eight, eight percent on mid. So as a Where caller, you would be saying to your team, basically, what? They found the points. Got just yes. got their combo coming in, so I think they might contest. But what are the chances of you winning it? Say eight percent. Yeah, it's pretty high. Yeah, yeah. You shouldn't give them respect. Yeah, you have that. You, they're two down fresh. Six versus four. What's the problem? You have heals. They don't have an advantage much. Ten percent is fuck all. And yeah, I don't see the problem. So yeah, your chances went considerably up because A, your medic didn't die. She used the Uber in time, so that was good by your medic. It could have cost you dearly though, but you had it in time, so that was good. And you got a pick, Crumbo. Um, Crumbo got a pick, sorry, on, on second. Yeah. Oh, sorry, um, the scout so and, uh, yeah, and the, and the soldier. Yeah. The scout and I yeah. Just yeah, so it was good basically. You got two picks, it's good enough. You used your Uber to get the point, no problem. Yes, they have respawn wave times, but it's irrelevant because they've just lost two fresh and you have six up. Now the difference is though, your six up, some of them aren't from second reset. Yeah. So that's uh, why the percentage. Is, yeah, that's why the percentage is about seventy, eighty, because now you just need to focus fire. So the soldier should be on, on their boxes. So Crambo, that should be you. You should be on their boxes, spamming house, while you'd scout and a medic cap the point. Because yeah, because you're holding forward. You you're putting them off. I'm actually trying to contest with the spam, while they're busy capping merrily. You know, on the point. That's how it works. Cool. Okay. Um, so, and pause. So you're all looking behind for some reason. I'm not sure why, but I don't matter. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, then you just decide between you who's gonna watch behind. Oh, and better catch so many nudes. Yeah, I wonder why. Because we we didn't have someone to train it, and then we go for the heavy plays from Teapot for some reason. That's I good. still don't know why. I, I love that. heavy. I, I I have no problem with it. Trust me. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Head, no, heavy on defense is great. You're not on defense. You're on aggressive, so it's not the best because you know, especially know. on spiral. But on defense, it's fucking great on Badlands. It's really good. And then Leary gets mm. picked, so our chances just go way down. Yeah, because this is my so we back off straight away. Okay, so let's pause it here. So what? Okay, so you got. I've got heavy just jumping back <laughs> onto the middle. <laughs> um, so what are the chances of you holding this now? It's um, been reduced by like thirty percent. I said fifty fifty. Fifty fifty. It is. Say, it is I'd on say the. They're forty percent. They're definitely going to push in. So it's on the wire. Okay. So why? Why? I say. I want to say on the wire. It's fifty fifty. Now, why do I say it's fifty fifty? Can someone tell me the factors of what I'm thinking of here? percent. No, no, no. That's. I mean, the demo going down is definitely a a decrease. Fine, I get that. But you have a heavy. <laughs> but, no, no. Seriously, this is where the heavy on defense becomes so powerful. Okay, but what is the heavy dependent on? Uh, like being in close range or getting yeah. to jump on them. Uh, yeah. Okay, but what's he also dependent on his head? <laughs> they have a sniper. <laughs> Yeah. Yeah. So what are the I chances don't... of them getting the heavy? Pretty high. Okay, so why is it pretty high? 
because they because... have a sniper error. <laughs> no, 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 no. Sniper, but what, you, scout. Yeah, but what do you have? You have heavy. No, but you you have other you, you have two soldiers. You see what I mean? So the chance that the odds of you holding this are fifty fifty without a demo, if your soldiers spam the sniper. Because if a sniper gets spammed, you can't do anything. It's you know period. What that's, that's you know there's no way around that. If he gets spammed constantly, and you alternate oh. the rockets, he won't be able to do much, right? So I think that's yeah. what we might actually do. So so no, you're, you're, I got I got blocked up with the sniper. Your percentages. Okay, well your percentages are 50-50 here, technically, even though you're a minus a demo, because you have a heavy, the heavy should be standing on their boxes, on 450, um, your medic, she needs to be behind the heavy, on the point, healing him um, at a distance, but also so the sniper can't get uh, her at choke, because the sniper will probably be at choke, won't he? But at the same time, another factor is the fact that the soldiers should be spamming choke, so the sniper has no comfortable zone of just getting a pick on the heavy, because the sniper may get 150 on the heavy, but it's not enough to kill him, really isn't. You know, he's got three chances to stay alive. 150, 150, 150 while being healed. He's not going to even die after three quick headshots, is he? Because he's being healed. Yeah, so. exactly. So, so that's why I'm trying to say what are the percentages of holding this. Still 50-50. It just depends on two things. You're heavy and being in the, in the position and your soldiers doing their job. So, um, I'm going to guess you don't do that, though. <laughs> <laughs> I got blocked up with a sniper. You got headshotted, you said? No, I, he... Basically, like, he couldn't let me move, I was in a corner, and I couldn't come out, because he was watching. <laughs> what? Yeah, so you need your soldiers to help you, basically, because no, otherwise... Watch, okay, so let's, people. uh, let's unpause. This is so amazing. Unpause now. <laughs> oh yeah, and you do this fail valley jump, where you go under valley, and then you don't get the close range. Oh, we do spam him? Yeah, we do. The heavy needs to be on... Yeah, you need to keep spamming him, though. You need to keep... No, no, you need to keep spamming him until your demo spawns. So now they've ubered. Now, we get, we get decimated to yeah, because we're uh, starting, he's out of position, and he's trying to like focus yeah. fire trying to the, take sniper. Down the sniper. Yeah. <laughs> so, okay, so the odds are very low now. Yeah. <laughs> but it could have been easily avoided. No, I'm telling you now, if they ubered at choke and you had a heavy on the box while soldiers were spamming, there's no way that soldier or demo could have jumped in. Period. Are you on? Are you on pause? Uh, yeah, we on pause ages ago. <laughs> oh. Okay. Let's wait again. We up. Uh, um, I'm on. I'm on twenty-three thousand seven hundred and forty-three. Oh yeah. Thousands. Oh right, you're way ahead of me. Yeah, twenty. That, nice, that, that yeah. nice find, by the way, is Lish and the hat. <laughs> That's no one. Uh, okay, yeah, I'm fine. Yeah, everyone's I'm there. into position of twenty-three thousand seven hundred and forty-three. Yeah. 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 Okay, yeah, I'm uh, now. So um, yeah, the chances of you holding this are pretty. Oh well, our demo gets picked again, so. And they're like already on the cap, and we just have nobody contesting, so I'd say it's pretty much hard. Lost, yeah, it's lost, okay. It could have been, it may have been saved if the dumb man was, had good health or was with a medic, because they have no heals, but yeah, he got picked, so it's irrelevant. Okay. Um, percentages are pretty much the same, so your percentage of holding is pretty good. Yeah? Mm hmm. Okay. So you're trying to get the sniper, I get it. The thing is, we were also slightly intimidated by the sniper, because he is actually UGC Platinum as sniper, so... They've been building better as well. That's not going to be another problem. Your medic needs yeah, to switch, we... your medic's going to go down. Yeah. They were building much better and they should get the point here. Yeah. Yeah, you were only 10% sure, and it was somehow to 20 then. Cost you. Okay. Uh, now back to middle. Oh, wait, I'm still on where they're there. I'm still on the last defense. What? Okay. I'm still on the last defense. Oh my god. I've just got to middle. Yeah, same. Yep, same. 29,523. Are you on 100%? Yeah. Like, speed, playback? I should be. Yeah, I am. I, don't, I think I'm just pausing it just to like okay. have a quick look around. Twenty nine thousand five hundred and twenty three. I've just like everyone's just spawned. Yeah, well wait, just get on that tick, twenty nine thousand five hundred and twenty three. And let us know when you're on there. Speeding things up a bit. Five hundred and twenty three. Mm. Yep. 
Okay, yep, everyone's I'm on. ready. Okay, so yep. I'm pausing now. So we go for the double bomb. Once he gets picked, we get the med. Uh, we also. So yeah, uh, we odds are of that, pausing with... it now. Pausing. <laughs> uh, odds have... of winning this. Ha their med is down. Uh, oh, I they, so. I'm they have say. five. We've already been like knocked out. Thirty. Yeah. Thirty. Yep, yeah. Much. Thirty. Forty. Yeah. It's not even that. I mean, you'd have to do some magic, really. Mm. But yeah, so it's pretty much lost, so you drop out. Chance of holding second? Wait, what dick are you guys at? I'd say pretty low as well. 31,000. Why? Okay, let's pause it now. I'm at tick 31,328. Yeah, I was a bit behind. Okay. Um, so I just okay, asked the yes. question of what's the percentage of holding? Yep, yep. Zero. Choke. I'll say zero. Really? No, choke, choke. Zero. Um, yeah. I was about middle. I was about middle. No, no, no. no. Middle, yeah, zero is yeah, zero percent. Uh, choke. Uh, um, second. Uh, I'd say 30 maybe. 40. Because they haven't come in yet and quite a lot, of, quite a few of their players are low and they're all still on mid. So only and 40? You think 40% chance you'll be able to hold choke? 65, 70. Much higher, 50. yeah. It's much higher. No, no, it's much higher because they have no heals. You just said it. You even give the answer away. You said they have yeah. no heals. They're all weak. <laughs> Why would they push in when they're all weak? They're not. So... Chance of you holding choke are quite high, right? So yeah. you hold choke. Okay, so another thing you need to calculate. So okay, you have a full uber charge advantage as well, like about eighty to eighty-five. So not a yeah. problem. At this stage, you should be just waiting. So let's unpause it. As long as the dumbman doesn't die here, that's the main thing. Yeah, yeah I'm trying to hold Reese up against the cool. scout. I was going to say the chances of a medic being forced here, but. I I don't think they could jump, they were too weak. They are bullying you, they do like to they do like their their, their demeanour is very much aggressive and they're like, You're shit, we should be there. Basically that's their demeanour, is what it looks that like. That is. And yeah. then that's how they act in the chat yeah. as well. <laughs> so you've even in here, need to get a pick, really. You get one. Need one more. Nice. Scouting house. Uh, I die. I just kind of like overcome by him. Oh, you're gonna lose players. Ah, oh, shit. Chances of of uh, holding this? Holding this? Um, well, med just I'd say down. like. Are we paused? Yeah, pause now. Yeah, yeah sorry, pause now. Just now. There are oh. two scouts and a and a solly med and no, two scouts are dead and a solly. Sorry. Okay, you so I would somewhere. actually say I would actually say about fifty to maybe forty percent holding it. Yeah, yeah. I, was, I would say if we knew their health, we could hold it. Uh, it's, it's not dependent on their health. Something else is dependent on intimidate us. No, they probably is on the crates, and we've got their meds just down. And so T Bush is about to grab a health kit, and so and they're all just being like, they're both their demo and their scout are just being spammed out by Hansi, who's got height advantage. So I'd say it's about sixty. Yeah, it's higher. Um, people, you're if, echoing. If oh, I, okay, sorry. If I was um, if I was a pocket soldier with the medic there, um, I would definitely not give up the point. So the chances of losing this would be next to nothing, as long as a, um, Omni doesn't die. Uh, yeah. and also B, I would be telling my medic to drop back to our house while I watch outside on the slope, onto the point. Now there's a good reason because what is the percentage of of them maybe bombing onto the medic? I know. Let's just say you don't know what their health is. Okay, it's irrelevant. High. <coughs> yeah, it's very high, isn't it? Because they lost, they just lost theirs, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So you would be telling your medic to, you know, or your whoever's, if your medic's making one, the medic should be dropping back to the house. Because what does that mean? It means that no one can actually get her from the air. So no man jumping in or a soldier, it's very hard for them to actually get into house territory, isn't it, if she's inside? So, and what you're doing is you're buying some time until you have spawners. So your demo and your scout are going to spawn in three seconds. But at the same time, you're saying, oh, no, this is our point, because you have the heals, right? So you just got to stay yeah. alive here. So the percentage of you actually holding this, if you play it right, is pretty high. So I'd say 70, 80. Um, if you play it right, so yeah, the scout just needs to stay alive, did his job, got the medic, and just needs to drop back onto your boxes, and the soldier is on just out the other side, the entrance of the house, while your medic's inside, and just waiting until you get spawners, and then it's safe to go, and then, yeah. So yeah, that's, uh, that's the sort of the calculation of it. Um, 
Well, that's on pause. See where the medic's position is really exposed. If you think about it, if someone jumped in, she's going to have to do some sick surf or something. You know. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. But, but, they, don't, but, but they don't jump in. It's fine. It's fine. So, yeah. so you've got a good chunky advantage here. Um, likelihood, uh, likelihood of them switching to sniper? Quite high. No, but they don't. <laughs> it is surprising, it's, right? It's well for two reasons. I think it'd be quite high because one, we have an uber advantage, and two, they've got a player that really likes it's good. sniper. Yeah. So, um, yeah, I would. I'm just trying to put that into factor. So you're talking about light classes switching. Well, that's one to think about. You know, um, what are the chances of a sniper being there? Quite high, which yeah. means um, who dies actually? Oh, you scout. You have advantage. You don't need to be bullied out here. Down man's wrecked. He should be going down. How is he not dead? Wow, forty-three on the point. Soldiers really need to focus. Oh, he's going down, isn't he? Good job. Okay, cool. So your chances of of winning last? Pausing it here, by the way. Pause it here. <laughs> really high. Yeah. Okay. Is it really high? No. no. I oh no no it, it, it is high it depends though <laughs> that's the thing <laughs> if it, if you move in immediately yeah that's that is the key factor because they've just lost the demo they don't have the UB yet and you're already capping and you're halfway you need to go now and if you don't go Hansi, now Hansi's already at last yeah but your majority of your team are not that's the problem yeah um, now if Hansi gets the medic then it obviously changes everything but my point is potential of winning this depends on the play from your team and most of your team are not pushing forward You've just killed two, including a demo, which is humongous. Like, that's huge. But the thing is, they have Uber. So by the time they get Uber, if you look at it, they're on 70%, right? Let's just say you don't push. They build that Uber. Then you've, you pu you're pushing at the same time as they've just got the Uber. You force it, but then the Delman just spawns. Yeah. <coughs> so, yeah, it's a bit... You need to go now, basically, to really have a chance of winning it, which you will. But I don't, I'm going to guess you don't, because your demeanor doesn't look like it. Your structure doesn't look like you're about to push. I think we do then. Let's some pause this. So you just lost Hansi. The medic's not building actually for them, it's very slow. Now he is. Now you see, look, he just dropped back. Right? The medic's still not building though for them, <laughs> that's quite horrific, but whatever. Um, yeah. Oh, that was it, right. I can explain what was happening here. Half of us were pushed again, the other half refused to. Yeah, okay. Yeah. You can't, you what can't. happened, uh, even though it's because demo's our main caller, right? But yeah. uh, me and me and uh, Thingy said go in, so we walked in, okay. and they fallen back to choke yeah. with these things saying that because they will have a Rule massive of... <laughs> Uber advantage. Okay, rule of thumb whoever the main caller is, you follow. Period. Now, you may be right, which you were. I can't disagree with you. However, you go over it after the match. If the Dalman calls something, if he's your main caller, then you follow that. Even if it's wrong, because what happens is you'll get people doing half and the other people doing the other half. And what you'll end up doing is losing players, won't you? So it ends up becoming worse. Yeah. yeah I mean, the Dalman will go, oh, yeah, you're right, we should have pushed the last once you watch it again. But there's no point arguing about it now. Um, and you might as well just try and follow the call. Ah, your chances of winning this are quite low, but then again, Demo's on the point. No, he's not there. Yeah, you're gonna die here. Yep. Uh, yeah, just take that as a rule of thumb. I have that a lot when I was in Prem, um, talking to, calling for players, and they would argue, say, do this, but look, I've called it. If I've got it wrong, just berate me afterwards. I don't care, but I've called it now, and I expect this. Uh, otherwise, don't, don't expect me to main call. You can't expect someone to lead. And then they say, "No, I'm not going to follow you." <laughs> Doesn't work like that. Yeah. No, they could be wrong. They are. I mean, I say could be. They are going to be wrong. They're going to get some things wrong because they've they haven't calculated the variable that's in the, in their <laughs> sort of calculation, basically. So it's fine. They can make mistakes, but it's got to be followed. So in that situation, Cranber, you were right. Like I would have gone in, but no mind didn't think so for whatever reason. And uh, yeah, so they've got Uber here, and um, percentages. Let's pause it here. Percentages of them. Getting this? Getting point. Yeah, the point, CP3. Well, um, 50, 50, it's higher than us. Higher than us. Yeah, it's oh, no. It should oh, no, be higher than us. Yeah. 60 yeah. to, 
I would say 70 70% I'm getting it because they have an Uber and we are nowhere near an Uber. Okay, so if that was the case, right? Oh, just a minute. Sorry, I just lost a few of. Yeah, okay. If that is the case, you know you got an Uber disadvantage, and I'm pretty sure you guys know they have a sniper. I'm guessing so, because the dumb I keep spamming with the soldier to put him on. Yeah. Yeah. So if that is the case, um, your percentages of winning this point are less than them, because they have an Uber and they could easily jump on you. Uh, what are the chances of you losing your medic here? Where she's standing? If they push, let's um, just say they push. If they push, I would say quite high. Okay. Sixty to seventy. Yeah. Okay, so where yeah. should your medic she, be? She well, she's in the right place for a sniper. But like you said, should be in the house in case they get jumped. Okay, because the sniper can't see from now from choke. Yeah. So, okay. So my point is, dumb and the soldier are fine spamming, no issues, because they're putting off the sniper and they're also buying time, which is what you, you I'm guessing you're doing it for, because you're yeah. building the Uber while spamming the sniper so they can't move in. Blah blah blah. But the medic needs to be in a better position. So, first percentages of how likely are they going to give this get this point? Uh, quite high. Fine. Fair enough. What are the chances of you being able to hold second, i.e. choke? It depends on, obviously, how many of you stay alive. So, um, that that relates to the medic, ideally, because you're all going to be tagged when they're trying to push in. So, your medic needs to be in a good position. So, at the moment, it's okay, but it's not ideal. Um, I see some pause it now. And they've Ubered. And she... And she's down. Yep. So uh, that's why I asked the percentage of her going down. <coughs> See the two factors that I brought in. Factor was one of how what the chances of you holding this, and the second one was the factors of your medic. Somehow they fuck it up though. I don't know how, <laughs> but either way, this point's yours. Good job. Chances of you winning this are very very high now. Um. Yeah, this is where you need to get out. Oh, they pause it, do they? They do. Yeah, they paused it, haven't they? Is that yeah, right, guys? Yeah. I, I mean, I haven't paused the demo, but they've paused it. I mean, you guys had a yeah, pause yeah, in the yeah, game. Yeah, we paused the yeah. game, yeah. Do you know how... Is it, was it long, or... Do you know, or... Game, I, think I it went don't think minutes. it was really long. Oh, the it can't be that long. long. Let's just wait, then. Um, I need to fast forward. Okay, so... I'll, the let, main I'll let you know the tick. Okay. I'll let you know. Um, so, I'm I'm hoping you guys are getting uh, uh, a repetitive thought here of of the two factors I'm always bringing up: chances of you winning a point and chances of your medic staying alive. I think that's the second. Yeah. One. I think the second one is a is a, a a new thing for you guys. Really, you don't really think yeah. about it that much, but it's really important, as you've seen, because your medic's almost got it, and it's costly. Um, so uh, yeah, you need to be careful with the numbers that you have for what's up and what. Okay, it's it's, uh, it's unpaused now. Yeah, I'm already. I'm actually yeah, mine's still unpaused. Yeah, I'm on fifty-six thousand at the moment, but it's still playing. So. Yeah, I'm the same. Cool. Okay, so they've lost. Oh, the HUD's broken now, isn't it? Because. Uh, yeah, it's broken because mm -hmm. it was paused. So anyway, I'll just scored. Right, so um, looking at this, the oh, HUD's still broken. 50-50, uh, right, going into this? Or not? I can't tell. So who oh, has... HUD's back, HUD's back up. Who has um, the advantage? Uh, wow. Well, we have crits. Wow. He just used it, but yeah. He, I mean, in theory, we saw before, before that crits, who had the advantage, really, of holding that? Them. They did. Yeah, of course they did, yeah. Because um, they had a pyro. But... Uh, I didn't realise the medic switched to crits, to be fair. I didn't see that. It's actually a very good play, because it changes a lot. Um, the HUD was broken, which really didn't help because of the pause, yeah. so I couldn't really calculate it. Are we still crits now? I don't think so. Yes, you no. are. Yes, you are. Yeah, we are. This is alone. That's... Crambo eating a grenade like a boss. <laughs> yeah, never mind. Get get out here. Was that because we bombed? Keep, uh, no, no, no. I would, medic should be healing. Never turning her back. Never turning yeah, her back. Yeah, I don't know what is going on at this point. No heals whatsoever, and that's <laughs> with. Never mind. 
Where's the medic? No, it's the scout. It's fine, it's fine. Calling for, calling for medic. Oh yeah, and this is Chances where of holding this? this? Second. Holding I second. haven't paused this, by the way. Don't pause it, it's fine. Chances of holding okay. this? <laughs> Zero. Oh, uh, yeah. We're, we're Why would you say that? Already. Let's pause it now. From our, from our positioning, it seems like we're about to back out. Oh, well, you have crits, right? Are we paused? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah we Maybe we're playing a bit scouts. passive to get the crits and then take. I mean, you've got, what, 60 in the crits creek at the moment? I have 71. I'll just do it until you've got 71 then. Yeah, like, she's, on, just... she's on 93 for me at the moment. Oh. Yeah, yeah I'm just... about there. So you don't have position, but you have the crits. They have Uber, but the chances of them losing a couple of players are... Quite high. Yeah, yeah. quite high, right? Yeah, I would say holding it 60 to make sense. Okay, and more importantly, the chances of you not committing to try and hold second, or at least force them, and losing last, what are the percentages? Fairly high. Fairly high, right? So if you if you if you try and hold on to this crits to l on last, and then you, they push with Uber, the chances of you losing last are quite high. Yeah, it's quite high. Yeah. So you need to actually the percentage of you holding this all depends on you holding second, not last. Okay, so let's unpause it. The demo needs to be in position. He's not really in an ideal position. And a Uber. Yep. So you force them, that's the main thing. And they lose two, it's great. But they still cap. Oh, does soldier save? He saved it, he needs some help though. Good job. Yeah. Nice combo. We save it and then yep. they just yeah, watch this. Both jumpers. Oh. And dead. Okay. Never mind. Either way, you forced. <laughs> no, but it's fine. It was a good move. You forced the Uber. No. Chance of you losing this? Uh, uh, straight uh, in. They're all up, but they just got wait in their spawns. I think what happens here, scout comes up behind them. And then we were just being heavily distracted. Haha, <laughs> that demo! <laughs> <laughs> it's like, yeah, yeah, no problem, I can take these stickies on. Oh, they aren't mine, I'm colorblind. Okay. <laughs> okay, whatever. But uh, chances of you holding this are quite high still. However, your medic is still on crits, and they're, you're actually at a disadvantage in terms of heals and percentages. So, um, yeah. If, they, if the enemy <laughs> team have half a brain, they should really push in before you crits in. Because the percentage then becomes really, really... Yeah, they have. <laughs> there we go. And your mate doesn't even have it, and she should go down. Yeah, yeah, it's obvious. Um, that one there, basically. But yeah, um, goes down. And, and yeah, then. you've lost this. Yeah, you've lost it. You've lost it. As soon as you, as soon as they come in b with the Uber before you use your crits, crits you know, yeah. you, you know you're in trouble. That's a good like 80%. It's about to be failure <laughs> for you guys. Yeah. So uh, never mind. Still crits. Yeah, that's fine. Crits on rollout is irrelevant. It really is. Like, I mean, it, I mean, it can be really good, but it can be really bad. But it makes no difference. It could be Uber. It wouldn't make a difference, basically. Yeah. <coughs> like they lose a player. You lose two. We lose two. They lose one. They lose solo. We we lose our both our scouts. And then since we do this, I think we just kind of wait for our crits. Ah, you lost three though. Um, yeah, it's down to chances three. of holding this are very oh, very low. Oh uh, yeah. Okay, so let's pause it here. So I've just seen a dumb one go down, right? Is that yeah. the same for anyone? Or if not, you're yeah. about to see him go down. Okay, yeah. So a sticky trap. So the chances of you holding this are certainly a lot higher. Higher now. Right. Yeah. I'd say forty percent. Yeah, but it is. I would put it there because it's dependent man. on dependent on focus fire, right? So your man is spamming pretty well at choke. He needs your soldier to mm -hmm. focus the same because what that will do is it will put them pushing at choke. Even though there's something at haunter, it will push. It will put the combo off at, at choke off and then if you do that then your chances of holding it are a lot lot higher then so it'll go up to like 70 to 80 so if that was me basically if I was a dumb I'd be saying help me soldier spam 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 choke please but demo's down you know we have the power because we you know a dumb man with <laughs> yes 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 we have the power <laughs> a dumb man a dumb man, a dumb man with a, a dumb man up and then not having one you know you can do considerable damage so he just needs the soldier support basically um, all depends how it works now. So let's unpause. That's a good job. Yeah, that's really nice from the soldier, whoever that is. I can't see. Ah, oh, scout comes on flanks though. Yeah. It was a nice play though, the soldier pushing them back, but the scout came behind. Lusan does well as well, but yeah, you lost your medic and they have it. They have. I asked all mine as a player though. Um, 
I'm just going to pause it here. Okay, so they've got Uber charge advantage, right? But they lost yeah. the scout, right? So what are the chances of them um, them actually capping this in theory? Before, besides the fact that they've capped half of it for now, let's just say they didn't have that half. Uh, um, they have. Uh, are we saying that there's a guy on Spire just like starting to cap it? Or yeah. yeah. I say um, about fifty-fifty because they might back off to try and hold their Uber. And then they also have the height advantage since they've got a guy in Spire. Well, my point is the fact that what do not what what normally caps the spiral. Scouts. Scouts. And how many do they have? One. 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 Where is the other one? Down on the, <laughs> on the floor, the right? Next okay. to so how bridge. how useless is he for capping the point? Very. Okay. <laughs> so what are your chances of holding? I would say 50-50. At the moment it's 50-50. It genuinely is, even though they have Uber. If you guys stop whatever's on Spiral, um, they're going to have to end up using their Uber. And then you'll probably lose the point. Then obviously it changes. But then what does that mean? It also means you get to hold last. So, yeah, my point is I wouldn't be giving this up. I would be trying to hold it because the scout went down. Uh, I'm not saying go all blown onto it, but the more you kill, the better. Because obviously, if it's just end, if it's just a medic with Uber on 100% with one soldier at the end of the day, because the rest were hard to cap second, but you held it, it's pretty useless, isn't it, that Uber? Because what happens is your medic will be up and still building with someone. Because you won't all go for it. Your medic <coughs> won't go for it as well. So, okay, let's unpause it. <coughs> so your your demo does well here to try and hold, and your soldier jumps in correctly, I think. Yeah, he does. And he stops him, which is really good. Even though he's on six HP, blah blah blah, that's fine. <laughs> <laughs> you should really be trying to stop this. Everyone should be trying to stop this. Did and he not. just jump? Ah, uh, hey. but no one else did. And yeah. And then I try and go spy to kind of. Yeah, but that could have really worked out if uh, if you tried to hold this. You had spawners. Yeah. Never mind. So the percentage now of holding this. Uh, the fact that we have a spy means that it's slightly decreased, especially if, especially if I don't do... Well, because it's hit or miss, isn't it, with I'd, spy? I'd say they've got 80% chance of capping. 80% chance, yeah. and then I go in with the spy, and then, yeah, I'm down. So they just push in immediately, since they know that I'm one down. Yeah, it's lost. Yeah. See, and instead of spy, Uber. spy is, is, is a great play, but it's it's a very much a hit and miss, isn't it? 1-0, it's either 1 or 0. Basically, yeah. Yeah. but pyro is a nuisance, it's a pain in the ass. I would definitely go pyro normally. Pyro and heavy, you can have, and it's just so irritating <laughs> having a good pyro because, yeah, it means the down man and the soldier are effectively useless if the pyro is good. Mm. So, um, anyways, back to middle. Um, Oh, Hutsy gets yeah, absolutely so wrecked. <laughs> 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 ah, your soldier's about to go down as well. Yeah. Chance of losing this quite high. Medic needs oh, to drop look back. At me. Look at me surviving. <laughs> Chance of medic getting flanked. High. high. No one, especially when no one's capping the points. A bit worrying. <laughs> you should be. Uh, uh, true. true. And then we just got Crambo spamming. And then it's just demo. You should be able to hold this though. You haven't got the height advantage, but you will get it. You have the heals. You shouldn't be giving them respect. You have the players as well. Uh, okay, that's just going to pause it here. Pause it here. So I all I can see at the moment is the soldier just jumped up with the scout on the floor on the left with the dumb and a medic. Is that right? Pretty, mo pretty much everyone else? Yep. Yeah. How effective is a scout on the floor? Fine, my scout's just about to jump up. Scout, that scout's not very useful. Okay. So where should the scout be? Behind, flanking around the other side. Or? On point? Really? On point, yeah, of course. What is the most powerful position for a scout on this area? The point. Any, the anything that jumps up is fucked if he gets a meat shot, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. So why is the scout Why is the scout there trying to create more, more problems for the medic? Because what's going to happen is the scout will take damage, he'll call for medic, the medic heals him, may have to uber him, then drop someone else, or just the rest of the people don't have good enough heals to contest. The scout really shouldn't be there, is my point. So, what you, I don't know what the chances are of you holding this. Depends on what the other team do, so I can't really give you a percentage. But it's not looking in our favour, if that was me, because the scout is in the wrong position. So let's see what happens. Let's unpause. It takes AE, it takes down free, yeah, teapot goes down. That's teapot down, yep. Um, they they lose the their demo. Down. They lose their demo. That's a good pick. You can easily hold this now. You're gonna need some help. Yep. Soldier just needs to buy some time, but he's got a scout on him behind. Yeah, he needs some help here. 
and then we have a Roma on the point, and then with Solly. Solly down. Yeah. Good job. It's fine. You should do one I'm more. Down. Another Solly down. And then this just got scout up. He backs out. Oh no, he's going back for the soldier. Uh, then I think you just back out. And Let's you give it, it the, you give it to them, do you? Yeah. Because I think they just got the respawns in, so No, but you got close to spawns. Hmm. It's fifty fifty for me. I wouldn't have given that. But anyway. It's irrelevant now. Um the scout being there by the way, uh was a factor, no? Definitely. Yeah, yeah, because definitely. he died straight away. <coughs> Um, yeah, and he couldn't be saved because the medic was busy focusing with the combo. So anyway, um, they are building furiously. Do they have Uber or crits? No, they have Uber. They're just building better. Okay. I have noticed that they're building Uber much better. Um, like by you know that your medic's always ten percent short <coughs> or something for some reason. So I don't know if that needs to be looked at. But oh, they are, med went down. But they lost two. So your chances of winning this. Okay, so let's pause it. Chances of you recapping second are. About 80. Chances of um. you being back capped are. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Pretty high. I think that's what happens. <laughs> that is what happens. We get back capped by okay. a scout, I think. Okay. Chances of your scouts being picked off for not going the right way to get onto second. Let's see. It's pretty oh, high. Well, pretty high. I go the death route of. I think I go upper. Okay. Um, a little tip, the safest way, 9 times out of 10 for a scout to go onto Spire is from trash, believe it or not. It's the least place stickied or a soldier hides. <laughs> Just statistically, I'm telling you from experience. Yeah. You always have a down mind watching top right balcony or the drop down. You always have a down mind watching top left of the balcony when you go out there. You always have a down mind watching the front door on the right hand side. <laughs> the only place he doesn't really look after the most is because it's really far away is the right the left hand side door of lobby yeah and then you can just um double jump onto the ledges of each spire <coughs> excuse me um okay so you know that the chances are pretty high for you to be back cat but the chances of you capping this are okay so i would say 40 50 percent uh depending on what classes are up for them so they have two soldiers a scout and a demo so the chances of them going for a back cap are pretty high so what does that mean? It should mean that two scouts go to second, the rest should stay on last. Okay. That's how it should be. Um, even though you're only two players against three, you have heals and you also have better position. And you have a demo. You know, So it does mean that they can't do anything if the stick is on the point. Um, yeah. I'm not sure how this plays out, so that's some pause. Uh, you just lost a soldier. It's not the end of the world. In terms of camping nice. second, but we don't have anyone camping second and it's taking too long and there is a soldier in trash <laughs> well the odds <coughs> normally there isn't there though it shouldn't be why is it a double one capping I'm confused he has pain drain I'm guessing but that's oh just and I'll scout some more useful are they with the times two <laughs> <laughs> that doesn't make sense it needs to be scouts and spiral they do way more denial on spiral than a demo man does Oh, you don't get back cats. You don't get back cats, but they do have a spy. Uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I think maybe me and Liz get back to them. I remember that happening with <laughs> Although I'm pretty sure we do call like a spy demo or something. Chance of you winning this? Mm. Uh, we've already got folk on the yeah. point. We... So you're, you're two down here. Oh, so we are. <laughs> Three down, yeah, scratch yeah. that. Four down. And your medic's about to go down. I guess it gets yeah. lower as each person goes down. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> and then our meds alone, and then the spy comes in. Yeah. And goes bumps. for the kill. Uh, yep. Does he actually turn? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we're already on second. Fast, I mean, they're going to have a little advantage, but I reckon. Reasonable chance try of holding. And back, try and get a play. I'm not sure. Sure. I think I go try to get their demo. Yeah, I just get their demo. And yeah, then unfortunately, then it's irrelevant to the building of Uber, but it may buy some time. I could be wrong. Uh, it's a good pick, though, nonetheless, because it means they can't push now. But that's a soldier yeah. on point at the moment. He gets down. He goes down. Chance of holding this uh, with your current classes low. Yeah, 
I need, need a pyro on the bottom. Yeah. Uh, you need... We need to off class pyro more. You do. People. You really do. It's really powerful with flare gun. If you know someone to use that as well, it's fucking powerful. It really is. <laughs> I think it's our pockets our best pyro, but uh, that's a shame. Well, Your I'll demo to... goes down. I can reflect pretty well, but I can't flare gun. Um, we get capped. Yeah, you get capped because the damn one goes down. Yeah, and then they've already got half cap already, so yeah, we yeah. can have a tantrum, right? No, it's how I don't say good round once. Yeah, I know. And also when, like, when like when they ran around, the binds just came rolling through, and then when we ran around, it was just completely silent, and then it was just us going good round. <laughs> Yeah, but dicks will be dicks. You get it yeah. in school, you get it everywhere. Yeah. Um. Can't be misses a health pack. We're spamming. And we've got two down already. <laughs> and then our med goes down. I got... take up demo and then I run away shitting myself. That's fine. Chance of you <laughs> holding this? Demo. Chance of you holding this is still quite high. <laughs> yeah, it's just me up. That's a really good job yeah. by your scout. Does a really good job stopping, uh, buying some time for them to drop back. Also staying alive, best scenario they're really there because they they have a sniper now. Um, let's just say you know that. So what are the chances of you holding this? We pause it here, by the way. They have Uber um, as well, remember? We're all on the floor. Well, we're on the floor, well, but they let us say you know you know that they have a sniper as well. Um, I'm going to say we had 50-50, 55-60. Again, 50-50 depending on if, if someone Echoing does something. Again, but... Sorry? Yeah, echoing oh. again, big time, don't worry. I keep forgetting about that. Oh uh, yeah, I was just going to say, um, it is 50-50, only if something happens though, so... Um, if we spam the sniper out again? Well no, because they have Uber, don't they? Oh yeah. So what else could you do to try and deviate this, this percentage of Uber that they have? Send a scout For, around the flank. Force them. Well, what you could do, cleverly, like what you could do is you could have the down man and the, the pocket soldier. Pocket soldier on spiral, spamming choke, so the sniper doesn't get freedom. Your medics in trash should be really. The down man should not be on stone bridge because you know that they have a sniper. Um, and the two sol the sorry, the soldier and the two scouts could go on the flank and start going for a back cap. And what that will do is it will put them in two situations. It means go back they have the to go back. Cap. Yeah, but what that also means, well, how much time does that give you? Gives you another gives 15 us. seconds at least, which is another, what, 30%? bit more? Which means mm -hmm. you should have it in time. So the only way you could deviate this, because they have a sniper, remember? But they have a sniper, which means one less scout, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so... I mean, I could go into scrutiny and say on a, on a, on a minute level, as a demo man, I would be trying to get the second scout, because they only have one. So if I got that scout, they've got no one else to cap the point but heavies, which is AIDS because, you know, no man spamming on them or soldiers can jump them and they can't deny. They have to get air shots, don't they, basically. Um, so yeah, you could send people around from the flank as they're pushing choke, which will then bring them back. So that's the 50-50. However, if that isn't the case, then it's going to be about 80-20 like, to them at this stage. And I, if I was a caller, I would be saying scouts and, sol and flank go roaming, the roaming soldier, go for a back cap, but don't die for it. So i.e. if they come back for middle, just drop out, because you bought yep. some time. That's all you're trying to do, you're just trying to buy some time. So um, that's some pause. So 80-20 in theory, let's go for that, unless someone goes for the back. Sniper's in. Sniper's down, that's a good pick. So your percentage has just increased a little bit, hasn't it? Even though they have Uber. They're about to Uber here, aren't they? They've got to. Yeah, they have. Ah, started off so well. The percentage was good, but it's gone considerably down now. Although down man goes down, so ah, but you lost three. They lost. You lost four now. Got demo. Yeah, but you're four down, and you've got two soldiers that have got to take damage. Well. You have to get. Oh well, maybe I have to get the scout. Depending. It's all about Crambo. Ah, oh, Crambo. I'm disappoint. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Just kidding, but um, you did actually pretty well. I didn't think you would be able to hold it that well, but um, yeah. yeah, the scenario I gave you of where you should be would have been 50-50, but the positions that everyone was in really wasn't yeah. the best. Yeah, <laughs> so the percentages have changed considerably.
know, psychologically, if they bully you, you end up being afraid so much. Yeah. I mean, I know uh, they may be cunts in in real life with their chat and all that, but forget that for a minute. Um, as a psychological game thing, like if they keep on bullying you, you end up being so defensive and you lose position, lose composure, and all that. So you shouldn't let them, you shouldn't give them respect. Is my point. Yeah. When you when they don't deserve it. I mean, if they if they've clearly got Uber and you don't, then yeah, you just let them in. You say yeah, you can tell you what, you can have the point. We'll save the next one. But if uh, it's a situation where you think you can hold it. I don't see why you should give them respect. You should just be uh, out spamming them. Um, they've Ubered now, so yeah. Oh, you've actually got Uber though, so. Oh, you lost two though. Damn. Yeah, yeah no, so your chances of bad. losing this are quite high. Even though you've still got Uber, you're three down. You dropped onto the floor. Your chances are about 10% now. <laughs> 5%. No percent. <laughs> oh, oh, oh! Actually, you might be able to. Wow. Oh, no one gets a love it. No, sniper. Oh, there's some amazing like plays that are in this round. I think we just save it and then oh. what? Oh, what happens here? Is a five percent chance. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it was pretty low. I'm not gonna lie. You all dropped onto the floor. You were three, four down. I think, or three down. No, three down. They were four up. We all go in crazy panic mode, and I think they get a back cap if I remember, or do they? I think they. I do. I wouldn't be surprised if they did. Because they're like. I like I how I like how we have two soldiers on on last point. Oh yeah. Well, I, I didn't know he was there. I didn't know. I, he d was I, there. I did keep I did keep saying I'm on point. I'm on point. Well, <laughs> well, I didn't see you. It's cool. It's cool. The chances of you recapping this are quite low now because you've lost a player, yeah. which is especially a scout. So, yep, not good. Um. Oh dear. There's a scout behind. He managed to get out. Yeah, you need to drop back now, just completely, because yeah, you got no chance of uh, recontesting second. What the hell? What is the medic doing? Wow. SPO just got wrecked <laughs> on the left. Your demo goes down for it, but the medic goes down. They have a sniper now. Three versus three. Soldier main. Chances of this getting ninjaed by someone bottom left? Very high. I think this is, I think this is where we get back. <laughs> oh. This is where we get back. Yeah, yeah there oh. we go. I was going to say, percentage of something of ninjaing <laughs> from the flank. Very, I very high. <laughs> but again, something else is a main caller I would be looking out for, like saying, you know, I wouldn't be saying that to my team, I would say percentage of, you know, something coming at bottom left, but guys, watch bottom left, because the percentage is in my head, because of... they've got nothing to lose, they just lost their medic, which increases the chance of actually going for last, you know what I mean, because they've got nothing to lose. I think you should main call in rhetorical percentage based questions there. <laughs> Guys, percentages of uh, of something flanking. That's thirty five percent. Oh by the way, you've just been air shotted, you're about to die. <laughs> percentages have just changed. <laughs> it's all changed. May the odds ever be in your favour. <laughs> oh dear. Oh well GG's anyway, but um Yeah. Um a lot of pauses there, as you can see, but there's tons more percentages like calling I would have done, but they're the, like the main transition ones yep. that I'm bringing into play. Um, Fantastic. Has anyone got any questions? Like, I see if there's something that... It, that How do you prem? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I told you, if you're good at maths, you, you can do it easily. Uh, the, only, the only problem is that... I have with most people, like, uh, when I mentor them, is the fact that they're good at maths, but they don't know how to multitask. Yeah, my yeah, last teacher would be thrilled at the possible career yeah. paths. <laughs> <laughs> I can, I can multitask. Yeah. Well, um, would you have any tips for our team in general? I mean, I know you're doing the percentage thing, but um, sure, game, what kind? Just like positioning if we're aggressive enough, etc. What our main faults might be. Uh, positioning sure. was the main thing. Definitely yeah. positioning. Yep. Positioning was the the biggest killer of your percentage. If I was to say anything out of everything, it was position. Then the second thing would be build, uh, building over. <coughs> um, but I w that's not too worrying because that. Could how, be... how? I mean, like, how do you build over rocket? Then? So what I always do, I'd leave it up to the. I, I hit myself onto the rocket. I let it heal up nearly to the top of buff, and then hit myself <laughs> with another rocket. But is that the right thing to do? As long as it's under two eight five, you're fine. Okay, under 285. Yeah, under two, if it's above 285 for a soldier, it will charge slower by point something of a second, and that's repeatedly over, over every percentage. So you end up losing about 
two to three seconds overall. That, that point that would probably be why then, because what it is is that I leave it like up to two nine five or something. Then hit myself with a rocket. It's probably that. Um, yeah. Um, also, I just think we need to be able to scouts more just in downtime. Well, not downtime, but yeah. Um, it's up to you, like with the how you want to build it. I prefer to build myself as a soldier with CVM than with the scouts, because the scouts don't understand how they should be building you. But if that makes sense. Um, all I ever see is scouts just walking out of spawn, instantly building, thinking that they should be building, even though the medic hasn't called it. So when I play oh, medic, yeah. I'm always telling them to to not build, or I'm just going to let them die. So they end up stop doing it, because they'll die. <laughs> <laughs> um, it's the best way, it's, it's harsh, but it's the best way to teach them, because they shouldn't be building, because if they don't understand, most of, genuinely most scouts don't, aren't the brightest in the game, and that's why genuinely they play scout. I'm not saying T-Bot <laughs> isn't, hey, or, hey. Or, or the other scout <laughs> isn't, but it's, it is the least game sensed able class it is genuinely because at the end of the day right you could be a scout you could be really smart you can get into position but what what do you have to do at the end of the day you have to aim right <laughs> you have to, you ha yeah you have to aim okay but as a soldier you've got 50 50 haven't you you've got aim but you've also got the fact that you can splash with rockets and then demo man you've got 75 25 75 percent brain and 25 percent sticky traps and spam <laughs> and then medic is just pure pure like 99 95 percent uh, game sense of five percent surfing and and DMing and uh, arrows and all that crap, but you know in theory that doesn't have a much effect for medic, so it's about five percent. Um, 